This rivalry isn't based in geography. You could even make the argument these aren't even familiar foes. But the reason Arizona versus Wisconsin carries extra weight is because of their history in the month of March. If you're a U of A diehard, you haven't forgotten about the heartbreak of the 2014 and 2015 NCAA tournaments. In 14, the top seeded Wildcats lost in overtime to Wisconsin in the Elite Eight. The very next year was supposed to be the payback. Same round, another game in Southern California, Again, a heartbreaking loss to Wisconsin. Now, those were different teams and players, even different coaches, but the names on the jerseys are still the same. And because of that, tomorrow's Arizona Wisconsin game could be a chance for the Wildcats to exercise some of the program's demons. The U of A is ranked number one, undefeated, has absolutely been rolling teams at home, but Wisconsin is no slouch coming off two impressive wins over Marquette and Michigan State. The McHale Center will have the eyes of college basketball tomorrow, and the Wildcats are letting this rivalry fire burn. I know there's a significance, you know, you know, recent, you know, that, that, you know, a lot of Arizona fans feel passionate about, and I'm sure a lot of Wisconsin fans feel passionate about. So maybe it's fun for the fans to, you know, reminisce a little bit and uh, kind of get their juices flowing. We played them in the first round of the uh, NCAA tournament my freshman year. They do leave a bad taste in my mouth because they beat us by 20. Um, uh, in the NCAA tournament, so um, obviously this game is important not only for me but for Arizona basketball. The Wildcats and Badgers tip off tomorrow at 1:15. ESPN has the broadcast. We'll have the highlights and reaction right here on News 4 Tucson tomorrow night.